In this video, we're going to count down 10 ways to assess and reduce the risk of modern slavery in your supply chain. Internal audits can be highly effective and tailored to the needs or concerns of your organization. However, they do need identified, trained and skilled resources and may be time consuming or costly to undertake. And WIDER is a company that provides worker engagement through SMS text messages. This can provide a heat map of engagement for different locations and is relatively low cost to implement. Workers receive simple questions via text messages in their own language that they can quickly answer. They receive them at different times of the day, helping preserve anonymity. However, this method does require workers to be able to access a mobile phone and have a phone signal. Compliant 101 is a method of rapidly authenticating and verifying the right to work, construction skill cards, and worker identification for the UK construction market. It addresses the immediate site-based workforce, rather than people or organizations in the supply chain. PPAC ID is a document scanning system that authenticates and verifies IDs such as passports and visas via UV, IR and biochip. It provides face match authentication and flags forged documents. The CSCS card checker is a simple to use, free app, available for Android and Apple devices, to check validity of CSCS cards. These are required to work in the UK construction industry, but as many as a third of them in circulation could be forged. The app makes it easy to check. The UK government's modern slavery assessment tool is used for public sector procurement. Organisations that complete it will receive a score and recommendations for improvement. Reports can be shared with multiple buying organizations. Registration is required, but this is free of charge. You do not need to be invited in order to take the assessment, nor do you need to be a supplier to government to participate. SEDEX is the world's largest data platform for supply chain assessment, to store, analyze, securely share, and report on sustainability practices with 74,000 organizations participating. Pre-screening allows assessment of risk prior to procurement, and data can be combined with self-declared and audit data. EcoVardis is a proprietary assessment method to assess implementation of environmental social governance within an organization. Suppliers can securely share data via the platform, and recommendations for improvement are provided in the final report. There are benchmarks to compare your organization against others, and an overall bronze, silver, gold or platinum scoring system that helps summarize the results. Clearview is a certification scheme aimed at labor agencies. It allows them to demonstrate they operate responsibly, professionally, legally and ethically. Data can be connected with others and risk assessed via the SEDEX platform. Achilles, in partnership with the charity Unseen, provide independent ethical site surveys and audits, capturing feedback on employment conditions, and focused audits on company process and procedures, on engagement and employment of direct and indirectly employed workers. So, in summary, these are 10 ways to assess and reduce the risk of modern slavery occurring in your supply chain. Which ones will you choose to use? If you have experience of using these or other examples, please feel free to leave details and links in the comments.